yo 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 so today i got a package in the mail and this is from lady in red fragrance club genealogy collection i am super excited this is one of their new releases now this particular house they specialize in doing creed fragrances and doing replicas of creed fragrances i think i actually got a couple on my desk here and i can showcase those this one is a uh, creed creed millicene imperial and this one is uh, Cree Green Irish Tweed. This is a good idea of how the bottles look. These are 50 mLs, 1.7 ounce bottles. This is the atomizer for these. Great atomizer, great amount of juice that it kicks out. It's gorgeous. So the fragrance that they came out with, which is their new release, isn't a Creed fragrance. This one is actually Baccarat Rouge 540 uh love the love the bottle love the red uh red print on here you got the again you got the company info on the back ingredient and warning info as well the atomizer on this is the same as the others you're going to get a great distribution nice wide uh and full ish distribution on that one and a great fine mist now on this particular fragrance, they have their uh, note cards. So this lists all the notes that they utilize for all of their fragrance. It's like a little uh, little cheat sheet here. And on the Baccarat Rouge 540, you got caramel, orange oil, jasmine rose, amber wood, and mosses. Let's go ahead and get into the actual fragrance. We'll put a few on the arm here. And I love them. I love this company. Love this house. They have excellent, excellent uh, representations, inspirations of Cree fragrances. They do a wonderful job. This one here, the Green Irish Tweed. I love this stuff. This stuff is the best version of Green Irish Tweed that I've smelled. I end up picking up Trey Nuit when I first started in my journey and this is their variation of Green Irish Tweed and this smells so I don't say sour but something changed in the scent profile it's not as fresh it kind of got like this almost like a leather kind of a vibe like it didn't kicked in and it's, it doesn't smell bad but when you're expecting that fresh um when you're expecting that fresh, sparkly, vibrant, zesty fragrance, that's what you want. And you don't want to smell it and it's it didn't got a little murky or it didn't got a little flat, I guess that's the way to describe it. Their Lady and Rare fragrances are excellent. Great price point. All of these are priced at around $35, $40 at the most. And they have promotions going on all the time. Uh, very simple, straight to the point presentation, but just incredible performance on the atomizer as well as the fragrance. Let's get into the scent. That's it. That's everything that you will want in a Baccarat Rouge 540 for thirty five dollars. Yeah, that's everything that you will want. I love the way that this smells. Baccarat Rouge 540 is one of my favorite fragrances because it's so easy to layer with different things. It's so easy to uh, complement other fragrances and things like that. One of my favorite layers is utilizing this and the Creed Aventus. Uh, if someone has a 13ZZ inspiration, that's usually the one that I would want to layer it with. It smells excellent. Mm. That's everything that you would want. And a Baccarat Rouge 540 inspiration. Lady in Red knocked it out of the park. I'm going to be coming back to this scent and doing like a full review and just seeing how it performs on skin. Because Baccarat Rouge has a tendency to uh, get a little, go, go a little nose blind, you know. So I want to see if this will be able to stay with me in my nose and not just, you know, on me and on my person uh, and see how that actually performs. Uh, that is pretty much it. I'll drop a link in the description where you guys can check out this uh check out this particular fragrance. Check out the house. They got a few fragrances and they're all bomb. Check them out. You won't be disappointed in any of those fragrances.
Uh, that is it for this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and I will see you guys soon. Peace.